Atlas Angel, conducted in partnership with the U.S. Pacific Air Forces, marked a significant collaboration between the United States and the Sri Lankan military, with additional participation from the Maldives National Defence Forces and civilian experts from the Disaster Management Centre. As I look at the U.S. engagement in Sri Lanka during my time as ambassador, I'm extremely proud of all the ways that we have come together. We've built relationships and bridges that will have long-lasting impact to strengthen humanitarian assistance and disaster preparedness. Since 2022, USAID has also provided over $40 million in humanitarian funding to support disaster preparedness and response efforts right here in Sri Lanka, not only including responding to emergency needs responding from the 2022 crisis, but also working with many humanitarian partners and local communities to ensure the most vulnerable Sri Lankan household withstand floods, landslides, droughts, and the other impacts of climate change. We learn from Sri Lanka and the Maldives, as you all learn from each other. These concepts are about the international ties we form. It's about cultural barriers that we overcome. We all want to increase economic opportunity and the ability to prosper. We all want to have basic freedoms and be governed by democratically elected leaders that we can hold accountable. And we all want to live in a world where human dignity is paramount. Officials from the Montana National Guard, Sri Lankan Air Force officials and many other dignitaries attended the closing ceremony.